Are you a developer who wants to take your collaboration skills to the next level? Do you want to work on code with your teammates, regardless of where they are in the world? In this video, we're going to show you how to pair a program with remote developers using a tool called Live Share. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Jeremy, and this channel is all about helping you to become a better developer with the latest tools and techniques. Every week, I share insights and tips to help you level up your skills. In this video, we will talk about the benefits of pair programming and how to make the most of it in VS Code. First, let's talk about why pair programming is awesome. Pair programming is when two developers team up on a task, usually sharing the same computer. It's a super cool software development technique with tons of benefits. Let's go over a few of those right now. Number one, better code quality. We all know the saying that two heads are better than one. When two developers work together, they can catch errors faster and improve code quality. Number two, sharing knowledge. Pair programming is all about learning from each other. This leads to a deeper understanding of the code base and new techniques to try out. Number three, more productivity. It might seem strange, but pair programming can actually make you more productive. That's because you spend less time debugging and more time creating higher quality code. VS Code Live Share is an awesome tool that allows you to collaborate and share code in real time. When you use it for pair programming, you get some pretty sweet perks. First, there's remote collaboration. Live Share makes it easy to work on the same code base even if you're miles apart. This leads to more productivity and less in-person meetings. Number two, real-time editing. With Live Share, you can both edit code together and see your changes instantly. This means faster development and quicker bug squashing. Number three, shared debugging. Live Share lets both of you see the same debugging session, so you can team up to find and fix issues in the code base. Now let's take a look at how to set up Live Share in VS Code. If you haven't already, download and install VS Code on your computer. If you need help doing that, I have videos covering that. I'll leave a link in the description below. So in VS Code, we're just going to hit the extensions icon and search for Live Share. Here we'll click install. And that's all there is to it. So now, if we want to start a collaboration, we'll just come down here and click Live Share. This will start a collaboration session and you'll get a link to share with your fellow developer. Just send this link to the person you want to pair a program with. If you want to join a collaboration session, just come over to the live share extension here and click join. Your collaborator will need to send you the link that they generated on their end and just insert that here and press enter. Once you're in a collaboration session, you and your collaborator can edit the same code base in real time. You can also share debugging sessions and communicate through the built-in chat feature. Before I let you go, let's go over a few best practices for effective pair programming. Number one, set goals. Setting goals can make sure that you stay focused and are making progress. Number two, clear communication. Clear communication is super important so that you make sure everyone is on the same page. Number three, switch it up. Regularly swap roles between typing the code, the driver, and reviewing it, the navigator, so that both of you stay engaged and are sharing ideas effectively. Thanks for tuning in to today's video on the benefits of pair programming and how to make the most of it with VS Code. I'd love to hear from you. Have you tried pair programming before? If so, what were your experiences like? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, if you found this video helpful, be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more great content. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.